Rosa Parks. Rosa Louise Macaulay was born on February 4, 1913 in Tuskegee, Alabama. She lived in the time of segregation or separation of the races. Black people were not given the same rights as white people. Rosa married Raymond Parks in 1932. She joined the National Association for the Advancement of Colored People, also known as the NAACP. This organization worked to make life better and equal for African Americans. On December 1, 1955, Parks was riding a city bus in Montgomery, Alabama. Because of segregation, she was sitting in a section where white people had first choice of where they wanted to sit. A white man wanted her seat, but she refused to move. She was arrested, sent to jail, and had to pay a fine. The city's African Americans decided not to ride city buses until the segregation law was changed. The bus boycott was led by Martin Luther King Jr. In 1956, the U.S. Supreme Court decided that buses would no longer be segregated and black people could sit in any seat they chose. This was just the beginning of the efforts to end racial inequality. Parks was fired from her job and received threats by white people, so she moved to Michigan in 1957. She worked in the office of U.S. Representative John Connors, Jr. She was given two of the country's highest civilian awards, which were the Presidential Medal of Freedom in 1996 and the Congressional Gold Medal of Honor in 1999. When we hear the word civilian, that means that a person that lives in America. So any person could win these awards, but it's known for something really important or special that you did or a way that you stood up for something that you believed in. Rosa Parks died in Detroit, Michigan on October 24, 2005. Her actions were known to have sparked the U.S. Civil Rights Movement. <laughs>